السلام علیکم جیئر برادرز اینڈ سسٹرز اینڈ ویلکم ٹو قرآن ان اسلام وی ہوپ یو آر پریپیئرنگ ویل فار یور آخرا برادرز اینڈ سسٹرز ویئر تھنگس کین بی سین ہیپننگ ان دا ورلڈ دیز ڈیز بٹ اٹ امیز اس اس ایون مور دیٹ قرآن اینڈ حدیث آف پروفٹ محمد صلی اللہ تعالیٰ علیہ وسلم ہیز آلریڈی پروڈکٹیڈ دیم ان آل سینچریز اگو جسٹ ریسنٹلی سم فوٹوز آف دا پرائم منسٹر آف انڈیا نریندر مودی وتھ سم عربس فرام دبئی گوٹ وائرل دیز فوٹوز ور ٹیکن ان اے ہندو ٹیمپل and those arabs were actually the ministers of the government of the united arab emirates these photos have enraged the muslims around the world and they are criticizing this move by the uae government this step by the officials of dubai remind us of the hadith where prophet muhammad sallallahu ta'ala wasallam has already mentioned this holy prophet muhammad said the last hour will not come until some tribes and groups of the arabs indulge in idol worship with the disbelievers the arabs could be seen taking part in the puja rituals of the hindus as well in the pictures all of this aside uae has been developing quite amiable relations with india for the last few years and this only shows us how the words of our prophet sallallahu taala alaihi wasallam were nothing but the truth so brothers and sisters another sign for the end of times has been fulfilled we can see idol worship and hinduism getting more popular in the coming years which will complete this prediction fully hindus have spread in the world quite rapidly in the last century and it will not amaze us that in the coming future people will actually indulge in idol worship just like they used before the days of islam and this will mark the end of times as predicted in the hadith it is high time that we look at our deeds again reconsider them and see if they are good enough to be presented in front of allah on the last day May Allah grant us tawfiq to be better Muslims. Ameen. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon so that you don't miss an update. Till next time. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.